Very disappointed about the loss, it's sure. Very disappointed about the loss, it's sure. Uh, because I think in the first half we created a nice brand of soccer, very nice movement where we have to score. I think in the first half we created four or five big chances. Fortunately, we didn't score, then we conceded a silly goal. Uh, a stupid ball was to be clear out of the box, and then you give that to the the forward, the opponent forward who shoot and his goal. So they didn't do anything the first half. Um, us, I think we play very well in the first half. Then we get this uh, red carded. I think uh, uh, I don't criticize the red card, um, but I think that the officiating should have been more fair because there are some, some decisions that uh, should have been taken also against the opponent that, they sh should have, uh, that have not been taken. Uh, I saw for myself one penalty, one handball, uh, we get directly a yellow card, uh, they were buying time, staying on the ground, uh, the goalkeeper so many times also. If that is soccer, I prefer to stop to coach, because me, I like entertainment and soccer. So, uh, winning a game like that, uh, I, I, I don't appreciate at all. Then in the second half, again, we tried to push, but we were 10 against 11. You saw that uh, we took all the risk. We play with three behind. Uh, you sure that we were exposing our defense. It's normal. Fortunately, again, the second goal. Can you see the second goal? You can see. It's again a deflection. It's a stupid goal. It's not, it's not good passing like uh, the chance that we missed. You know, then uh, I don't don't talk about the third goal because we're trying to to come back and uh, that's that's soccer. Unfortunately, I think uh, we've been very unlucky today. Uh, also, we should have been more clinical in the box because, like I say, we create uh, some uh, fantastic chances on uh, very good movements. And yeah, unfortunately for me, it's not the the best team who won the game today. Uh, it's not the team who played the best football who won the team today, but it's like that, it's soccer. And we had to deal with this red card, and the opponent could have received also something, but uh, he didn't get. But I know the story, Yanga and uh, Zimba, and uh, I know I've been in Vita Club uh, uh, with Tipi Majembe, Zamalek, Alali, we know. For me, uh, all the games are. Uh, the same games, you know. All the games is three points, zero point, one point. You can play tomorrow Barcelona, or you win, or you lose, or you draw. So you know, it's the same thing for me. It's not, I, I told my players, and I told, I think, in the interview before the game, there's no small games and big games. I know for you, yes, for me, yeah, ah, Simba, Azam, yeah, young guy, yeah. But first of all, we have to look to ourselves. Um, I think we improve a bit. Uh, but unfortunately, the improvement that we did in tactically, especially in the first half when we were still 11, uh, with the big chances that we created, unfortunately, you have to punish the opponent. And if you don't punish the opponent, it, uh, we cannot win a game, you know. And um, it will be the same thing against Azam. Hmm? You know, um, we know we are playing a good team, and uh, yes, uh, we have to bounce back. We have to try to bounce back. It's only in three days. Now, big congestion of the fixture of the calendar, and uh, it's in three days, but we have to bounce back, especially to lift our left, you know, our head up and try to fight again and try to, to be more clinical in the box and try to collect uh, three points because uh, for everybody it's very disappointing. For the fans, for the technical team, for everybody, for the players. Coach, you have to